in this discussion you can see how to use sorted method and in case you missed previous discussion about what is the difference between search and underscore search filtered or mapped method please check link is given in description first I'm going to in terminal and here I will perform all the operations no need to go to browser and refresh the page and anything we are just using the that method only in terminal so if you don't know about this uh, filtered method uh, let me give you overview if you have uh, more than one record set you want to filter based on the fields then it is also possible we will see here like how to filter record set based on the fields then after we will see like how to reverse the result of the record set first let me add one object for the student profile self dot env school dot student student underscore list student obj obj dot search and here I am using all the 16 records for the double check you can see here 16 records but uh, I'm using search method so obviously it will give me a record set it's more than more than one record set and if I'm going to in browser and go to this student profile you can see total 16 records is available in active mode so you can see currently it's in ascending order right now if you want to permanently add the order by any other field something let's say school id then you have to use here underscore order and here you have to pass school underscore id that's it and let me exit from this terminal and re-execute the command and let me add the same thing like student list self.env school dot student then after search all the result and once I will print here you can see the behavior is changed the first comes as a 13 17 16 then after again like it comes as 6 7 8 9 11 12 or something like this right it is now based on the school underscore id it's a permanent change and uh, if i'm going to browser here and uh, refresh the page you can see the behavior also change so the first was xyz student but now you can see two three four student is comes first then after first student something like this and blank comes to last so I, I guess you understood the order by and this is a permanent effect in this model in this student model if you already have a record set and you want to filter based on the another fields with then it is also possible using sorted method let's see how to do like we already have this to list and simply we have to use here sorted then after here you have to add as a key like in which key you want to order by like I want to order by with the ID right now I will enter so you can see it's written the record set with the ID as an ascending order using this key equal to that's it but if you want to add as a school underscore ID then it is also possible if you press enter key so you can say something like this way it will return sometimes what happened there are many people are using lambda function it is also possible like stood 
then after list sorry then after sorted and here directly using lambda then after lm as an instance name i just created then after id simply we have to use like i want to order by the id of the of this models field and once i will enter you can see the result comes with the id And yeah, sometimes what happens, you want to also add uh, ascending while the stu student names. So you can also use the name field. So first is 12, 13, 4, 17, something like this. Right, for the double check, let's add the one for loop. And uh, stood in stood.nav. So you can see, so first it will return the digit one as a string, then after the capital alphabet, then after lower al alphabet. So something like this way you can use this sorted method. The question is why we used this sorted method. The main reason is you already have this stood underscore list record set. but you don't want to again fire one query to the database hey give me the data uh, order by the name or order by the school id or order by the id in ascending or descending order so it's time consuming like you are firing one more extra query to the database for the record purpose if you don't want to use multiple sql statements that time you are using sorted function Generally what happened is you have a record set again you want a record set based on the order by ID again sometimes like many developers using something like this like self.env student they are again using something like this search method ID in and uh, stood underscore list dot IDs and again they are they are using here like order equal to ID descending and it will return again the same record set but the main mistake is you are using the search method because search method again it will fire one query to the database then after it will create a new record set and that record set will return here so it's a time consuming let's say if you are working in a multiple processes like finding searching then after updating a specific fields and then again like you are while updating another another methods will call so that time it's a time consuming right again you are using this search method uh, only for the order purpose then it's better you can just use a sorted method because a, that sorted method won't be hit the sql statement sql query so let's see how to use a reverse one like let's say we are user using like sorted then after key equal to let's say name oh sorry we wrongly used list and uh, you can see the it's coming like this way but now I will add like reverse equal to true by default it's a false and if you are using as a reverse equal to true then it will comes as a descending order like 7 6 14 10 9 and so on the same thing you have to apply the apply in lambda function let's say lambda lm then after id sorry name and press the enter key and uh, if you want to use the two order by similarly then you can you can use something like this and lm.net
lm.id and I will remove this one so you can see something like this way you can use in case you have any doubt or query please comment below and see you in next session